this video I'm going to show you how to send a document to an email address also known as scan to email. From the main menu select email. You have the option um, up in the top middle to touch to input the address which simply means if you touch in there it'll bring up the keyboard and allow you to type in a one-off email address. But for this purpose I'm going to come into the address book and pick a name out of there we already have saved. So we'll come to address book only something, only one in here, so select that, lock that in with OK. And if you don't need to make any adjustments to it, you can simply hit the Start button and away that email will go. But in order for that Start button to be highlighted, you need to have a document either in the document feeder or on the glass of the machine. If you would like to make some adjustments, um, all your main options are right here. So the color mode is set to auto, which means if the page has color, it's going to be back in your email in color. Um, I know sometimes you want to try to get some more pages through and you have a file size limit on email like we do at Frasier. So if you want to force a couple more pages through, you can move it to mono too, which will make it strictly black and white even if the page is color. So you can lock that in um, and you'll see it move to mono. The resolution is set at 200 by 200, which is fine for text, but you have the option to move that all the way up to 600 by 600 if you have a page with a little more detail on it or some smaller images or words. Hit OK. The file format is defaulted to a PDF, which is pretty much standard. Um, you do have some other options in there, um, such as TIFF, um, XPS files. Um, the PDF can be set to OCR, which is optical character recognition, meaning when you scan that document back and open it up, it'll be a fully searchable PDF. So you can hit the little search button, search for a specific word, and that way it'll take you right to that page versus you scroll down and find the page that you need. Original is if you're trying to scan anything that's two-sided. So simply hit original and move it to two-sided booklet. Two-sided tablet is calendar style, so when it opens up in your email, the second page is going to be flipped. So the easiest thing to do is just set it to two-sided booklet. That way you'll get a nice clean scan when it comes back. Lock that in with OK. And the last option here at the bottom is exposure, the light and dark. You can simply move it to the left to lighten it or move it to the right to darken it. And you can lock that in with OK. Um, right up here you can see you can do the subject line or the file name. So if you want to name the file before you send it, simply touch in there. And this little option here is your LCD keyboard. So just bring that up and we can type in name of the file, lock it in with OK. Um, you see the CA button above start, that will clear all your options out and take you back to square one. So if you feel like you goofed something up, just hit clear all, that'll wipe it all out. But for this purpose, we're good to go. So we'll hit start. And away that email will go.